Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. It's auction day. And uh, we got too many boys. So we got two golden laced Wyandotte roosters and there's a blue laced in there. He's over here. There's a blue lace right there. Kept a darker colored one. Um, and then we have way too many Muscovy drakes. So we're getting rid of seven of them. No, eight of them. Eight of them as well. Hopefully uh, that helps a little bit with the feed bill. Hopefully I don't come home with a whole bunch of stuff. I kind of want it, but anyway. Sale. I need to get this stuff there. That way at least I'm not too far, you know, not too close to the end of the auction. I think next time I'm going to take a few geese as well. But I didn't catch them last night and I'm not going to chase them around today. I mean, I got, I had to go shower because it was a mess. I should have filmed it, but I was running behind. Anyway, let's get to the sale. All right. Well, not a whole lot here yet, but we got a black rooster, a blue hen, and a golden lace, it looks like. With the wrong comb. Not a Wyandotte, I guess. Not sure what kind of hens these are, but look like they could be a game breed. Some big white bunnies. Another bunny. Lots of rabbits, it looks like. Got a bunch of uh, bucks here, it looks like. Oh, wait. Buck, buck, doe. Doe, doe, buck. Doe, buck, buck. And buck, doe, buck. Bunch of rabbits. Bunch more fryer rabbits. They're here about every time. Same cage it looks like. Good size though. Great condition. Old solo red rooster. Uh, three old hens. Can you tell me more about them? These guys look like a bard. A couple of reds. Some more mini rexes. Doe, doe, doe. Yeah, right on. Man, I'm gonna sell a cage on that. It's gonna go for more than what I want to pay, but maybe I'll pick it up. I like, I love those broken. I have one at home, but I don't think I need another. Just a cage. Two bards and a red hen. Look like a little bit older birds. Though with the egg situation like it is, they might go for good money. Okay, how much are you going to pay for them? I don't have any. What are they? Toulouse? I'm not sure. My brain's, brain's blanking on me a little bit, but I would love a good pair. I might have to buy them. Bar Rock Hens. Look like they're a little bit older, just judging from the feet. Black Rooster. Not a super old bird, short spur. Last time they were going anywhere from eight to 15 bucks. There's an Aircona rooster. He's cool. I kinda like him. Looks like we got a bunch of barred rock roosters. Ooh, young guys. And a pair of barred rocks. And a bunch more. Looks like cockerels there. Still think that's a male. And a trio. Those are definitely older birds. Alright, guineas, we'll get to you in a little bit, but man, you guys are wild. We've got a bunch of uh, Paternix quail here. Heavy breeders. Another group. Another one. Even more. Duck eating eggs. Bunch of red hens. I mean, layers are hot. <laughs> Bunch of roosters here. 
can't tell exactly what they are, if they're a Delaware Cross or a Bard Cross, I don't know. And then we got some helmets. I do like the helmets. Don't need any right now, but pretty cool. Then over here, we got some goats. Hi, honey. Lady and her boyfriend. And the kid. Yeah, you nice. Hmm? Casting. And another young dwarf Billy. Anyway, not a lot of the sheep and goats here today. Some young guineas. Man, they look like vultures, don't they? Anyway, I don't need them, but you know, they should go cheap enough. Uh, barnyard mixed chicken eggs. Don't need that to pop open. That would have been a bad deal. Got some duck eggs here. Doesn't say anything about what kind they are. Some uh, quail egg cartons. Classic chicken flats. Is that color called Harlequin? I'm not sure. Someone knows rabbits a whole lot better than I do. Uh, can tell me what it is. Big old buck. Eh, it's probably a lion head. Or an angora. Look how fluffy the, you are. Um, is there a rabbit in there? Man. Oh, it's two of them. Okay, that makes way more sense. Probably angoras. Then we have guineas. As we've been having to listen to the entire time. So, that one there might be a purple, purple pied? Oh, it's got white breasts. Like this one here is a lavender with a white breast. I don't know what you call that. But I kind of like those oddball colors. I don't know if they're actually oddball, but you know, that's a pied. It's got the pearl gray top with the white on the bottom. Then you have like these royal purple probably. That one is, could be, I don't know. But they don't have spots like the uh, pearl gray do. Bunch of whites. Never been a fan of whites. The owls are drawn to them. Never do well at my place. Another mixed lot. Oh, I hear you guys. Chill out. Yep. Another group of guineas. Another rooster. I really could use a couple of marin roosters, but uh, haven't seen any so far. What are you, dude? Got a mini crest, he's got muffs, a beard. Guys, Eric Conacross. It's kinda cool though. Getting ready to leave, that way I can go home and do a couple things before the auction starts. What are you doing on the back of my truck? He's... I already took all the chocolate out. What are you doing up here? Huh? What are you doing? All right, if you get down, I'll leave. Yeah? I appreciate it. Thanks, bud. That's a good dog. Okay, you get a belly rub for that. All right, there you go. And the Scobies. I got some older hens. I mean, I don't need, I'm not, I just get, I'm getting rid of some grapes. But if I can replace them with hens, that'd be kind of cool. Even though I have plenty the way it is. Here's the big boys. You know what? You're pretty cool. I would actually buy that to replace one of the ones I have at home. The blue I have at home is kind of weird brownish blue. I'm not a big fan of the color. But I could do that. Or one like that. Man, I love blue. Looks like pretty much all hens here though. I'm gonna have to buy some of that lot. I wanna take that one home and that one home. I'd be all about that. Sounds like a bunch of drakes. Anybody hens? Sounds like all drakes. Probably peeking or peeking cross, something like that. I need that. Bunch more wrecks. And probably Rex Cross is here. Bunch more Muscovy Drakes. I 
fucking trees that I need there. Got a bunch of barred rock roosters. Look at some young birds. Bet those go pretty good. At least they should. These are Delawares. All roos. And then I'm pretty sure these are my cousins. Good old calls. Man, they're good looking though. They'll probably go for too much, but maybe I'll have to pick some up. Great calls. I think they're just cool looking ducks. Some more genies. A lot of big auctions, so who knows if stuff will go expensive or cheap. Holland Lotbuck and some dwarf does. Holland Bucks. And we got a bunch of dwarf. I love that color there. They remind me of uh, the fox breed. What do they call it? Silver fox, maybe? Or tan? Black and tan. I don't remember. Rabbits are not my thing, so I remember all these things from like 20 years ago that I'm not real good with. But it looks like a bunch more dwarves. And right back into lops. A bunch of lops. Lion head though. A bunch of lion heads, all bucks. Okay, that's what I need to know right there. I can see how people think they're cute because they look kind of like a cloud with ears, but not my jam. Pigeons. Looks like uh, some crossbred stuff. It definitely has some fancy blood in there somewhere, but probably not pure. Tree of Old English. It says it's a call, but man, you're a big one. Some more lavender guineas. What do we got here? More lavender guineas. And a potbelly pig. Your boy, what can you tell me about him? Avelina? Mini pig? Five months old. You smell like a big bud. And a silky, quote unquote, because it has the wrong color or wrong type of comb. That's a single comb, not a mulberry or whatever they're supposed to have. But silky enough. All right, row three. Now, these birds actually are my dad's. Uh, well, they were my dad's as of like six hours ago. Someone dropped them off at the shop. They didn't want them anymore. It's auction day, so. Here they are. Uh, similar story with these here. That guy actually bought for like six and a half dollars last auction, but turns out didn't need him. So uh, he's in here with these guys. Some white pigeons in a oddball. And we're back into Muscovies again. There are a lot of Muscovies here. But looks like a big crate of drakes. Probably a young drake there in the corner. My birds here. Got the two golden lace wine dots and one blue laced. Hopefully they go for good money. They're heavy birds. Yeah, those are mine. Well, uh, that's it for this video. Uh, I was hoping to get off work a little bit earlier. That way I could actually do a proper walk around the farm, kind of point out some things that I did buy, things I didn't buy, what I sold, what I have left, all that stuff. And uh, this video is about two days going up late. So sorry guys, this is what you get. But uh, really happy, uh, I mean, well, I'm happy that I don't have to feed those roosters and drakes anymore. Uh, it did pan out pretty good for me because the drakes actually paid for some stuff that I got. Um, I think I broke even at least. I think I came out a little bit ahead, but I'll cover that in the next video. Um, Prices on eggs and chickens, like hens, has been ridiculous uh, this last sale. Now, next auction, uh, not the next auction video because there's part two of this one, but next auction, I plan on taking a bunch of hens, um, thinking about taking some geese, 
probably a turkey or two. Uh, I'm gonna be selling a bunch more stuff. I probably end up buying some more stuff. We'll see. I do uh, plan on getting the incubator rolling. Actually, as soon as I get out of here, I plan on starting the incubator up tonight because I got geese laying eggs, um, turkeys laying eggs, I got ducks laying eggs. It's that time of year, so I'm pretty excited about it. The, I plan on doing a lot more filming around the, the house and the farm now that hunting seasons are getting over with. Speaking of hunting season, um, next video is gonna be a pheasant hunt. A wild pheasant hunt, okay? Not not a controlled shoot, um, but it it was such a good one. I'm so happy with it. Uh, I haven't edited yet, so at least the experience was awesome. I don't know if the actual footage will come out quite like I want, but uh, it was pretty fun. Anyway, hope you guys liked the video. If you guys did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up. That would help me out a lot. Um, likes, comments, all that stuff is awesome. Subscribe if you like the channel. Um, if you're interested in something that's, you know, this is what I do. I just do random things and hope that you guys like it. Uh, it's going to get a whole lot more random here in the next couple months. So, okay. anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry this video was a little bit drab, uh, but hopefully the next few will be a lot better. So, anyway, be safe out there and hopefully we'll see you on the next one.